Hello friends, I am Prashant Singh and you are watching Z Business. Welcome to another episode of The Right Property Show. It's a never ending debate. Plot versus flat. Should you buy a plot to construct a house on your own or should you go for a flat in some housing society? It's a million dollar question when it comes to investment in real estate. And that is why in today's episode of The Right Property Show, we will give you a solution to this dilemma by citing three major differences between plot and flat so that you can go ahead with your real estate deal with full peace of mind. Number one, amenities. When it comes to amenities, flat takes an edge over plot because flats nowadays in good housing societies come loaded with a number of facilities like gym, swimming pool, community club, park, meditation lawn, sports arenas and the likes. In case of plot, if you buy a piece of land to construct a house on it, then you won't be able to avail the benefits of these facilities as it will take a lot of money to build these amenities. Hence, amenities really matter. Number two, security and maintenance. If you go for a flat, then in most of the housing societies, security remains present 24 seven. Round the clock, security guards are at vigil to ensure that safety of your flat and vehicles is not compromised. Moreover, in flat system, the maintenance cost of the security gets divided among the residents. So that is quite economical. But in case of plot, you have to keep guards on your own and that comes with a heavy cost. Practically, for plot and own house, you have to pay for at least three guards every month, keeping in mind the eight hour daily shift of every guard. So, Plot and own house is a very expensive deal from the security and maintenance point of view. Number three, peace of mind. Buying a flat is almost hassle-free as compared to plots. In case of flat, builder does everything on your behalf, right from identifying the land to construction to getting necessary legal approvals to water system to electricity and much more. While in case of plot, you have to do everything on your own and that requires a lot of time. So practically speaking, when you pay for flat buying, technically you pay money to enjoy a hassle-free home buying. So peace of mind is really important. Now, even after taking all these factors into account, still both plots and flats have their own set of pros and cons. And eventually it is individual's opinion if he wants to buy a flat or a plot. However, always keep in mind that whatever you decide, the decision should prove beneficial in the long term. So this was the lowdown on the plot versus flat topic and the differences you should be aware of when it comes to real estate investment. We'll meet again in the next episode with whole new bag of information on real estate so that you can successfully find the right properties because getting the right property is your right.